We must carefully choose our actions regarding Qinghai's development. Our focus should be on promoting the unique characteristics of Qinghai. However, if any activity is not conducive to ecological protection, we must refrain from pursuing it. First of all, Qinghai's abundance of natural resources presents promising opportunities for green industries and green computing power infrastructure. Qinghai is uniquely endowed with abundant water, sunlight, wind, and land resources. These local clean energy sources are complementary and can be utilized in succession. In fact, over 31% of the clean electricity for the 2023 Hangzhou Asian Games came from Qinghai. Wang Weiqing, originally from Shanxi, moved to Qinghai to start his career right after graduating from university. He shared that a meaningful project inspired his dedication to public service in the clean energy industry. The project we're working on to connect every village and household is truly significant. After years in the electric power industry, we feel that electricity is the foundation of everyone's life and the cornerstone of economic development in the entire region. From the moment we started our work until now, we have witnessed the transformation of our city into one illuminated by the bright lights of countless homes. In this journey, we feel that our efforts have been rewarded. Especially in the past few years, as we have brought clean energy to various villages, including pastoral regions and grasslands. We've equipped them with mobile photovoltaic power generation devices, allowing them to experience the benefits of energy advancements. We truly appreciate the remarkable initiatives our country has undertaken. Among them, Qinghai is an important channel for the West East Electricity Transmission Project. It has the world's first ultra-high voltage line transmitting 100% clean energy, operational since December 2020, connecting the four provinces of Qinghai, Gansu, Shanxi, and Henan. In June 2024, Qinghai's clean energy monthly power generation exceeded 10 billion kilowatts, leading the country. Currently at Qinghai's Talatan Photovoltaic Power Station, the world's largest, an area comparable to Singapore, over 7 million photovoltaic panels stand where the Gobi Desert once lay. As a leading clean energy province, Qinghai must protect its ecological environment from being damaged on the premise of developing a full clean energy industry chain. We consistently adhere to ecological priority. Qinghai being the source of the three rivers makes the protection of its overall ecology our top priority. As a plateau region, Qinghai's ecosystem is relatively fragile, and since the three rivers originate here, it is essential that we safeguard these vital resources. Considering Qinghai's natural advantages, we propose the development of a green computing industry. The region is not only a natural harbor, but also benefits from a cool climate, making it ideal for data centers that can take advantage of natural cooling for 314 days each year. With a focus on green, low-carbon, collaborative, efficient, and reliable computing power, Qinghai Province aims to leverage its strengths to contribute to the national initiative of East Data West Computing Project. Hu Donggang entered this industry right after graduating in 2015, motivated by a drive to supply stable, green electricity to communities. Power generation is fundamental to our country's livelihood security. We take great pride in our role, as our responsibility is to illuminate thousands of homes. Beyond the essential tasks related to network transmission and communication, we also engage in areas like artificial intelligence and big data. This means our work is at the forefront of development, making it both meaningful and interesting. China has consistently upheld its commitments and is advancing on the green development path toward carbon dioxide peaking and carbon neutrality. In addition to its own progress, China's clean energy initiatives also benefit the global community. Photovoltaic modules, wind turbines, gearboxes, and other related products manufactured in China have been exported to over 200 countries and regions. 
making a significant contribution to the growth of global renewable energy generation and supporting the fight against climate change, benefiting both humanity and the planet.